What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Weekly Ranking Show, where we go through all the players that have gone up the ranks and the players that have fallen down the ranks over the last week. Not too many changes in the top 10, but there are a few changes outside of that top 10. So having a look at the ATP rankings for the week, no changes. This week, we have Novak Djokovic still at number one. Daniel Medvedev close behind at number two. Rafa Nadal at number three. Dominic Team still at number four. Stefano Tsitsipas, number five. Zverev at number six. Federer close behind at seven. Rublev at number eight. Schwartzman at number nine. And Matteo Berrettini rounding out the top 10. Let's go have a look at some of the players that have risen up the ranks. This week, we have Carino Busta. He rises up three spots, number 12 in the world, after winning a tournament last week in Spain. And also, Muner is up 14 spots to 81 in the world after finishing runner-up in that same tournament that Carino Busta won. Some of the players that have fallen down the ranks this week, we have Christian Garin. He's gone down four spots to 24 in the world at the start of the clay court season. Also, Andujar has dropped down 10 spots, down to number 80 in the world. Jumping over to the WTA rankings for this week. Not too many changes here. Ash Barty, she is still at number one. Naomi Osaka at number two. Simona Halep, number three. Sophia Kennan just behind at number four. Alina Svetolina very close behind Kennan at number five. Andrescu is number six. Sabalenka just behind at number seven. Serena Williams at number eight. Karolina Pliskova at number nine. And Kiki Burtons has dropped out of the top ten, being replaced by Kvitova, who goes up one spot and is back into the top ten. Let's go have a look at some of the players that have gone up the rankings for the WTA. We have Kudamatova, who is at a career high number 29 in the world, going up nine spots after winning the WTA 500 event last week in Charleston, and also Kovinich going up 26 spots to number 65 in the world after getting to the final in Charleston last week, eventually losing to Kudamatova in that final. Some of the players that have dropped this week, we have Ferro, who's dropped down 12 spots to number 57 in the world, and also Hercog has dropped 16 spots down to number 76 in the world. So there it is, the rankings for the week. Let me know down in the comments below. Are you surprised by any of these rankings? Some players have really risen up the ranks ahead of the clay court season. A lot of the players from the top 10 in the men are playing this week in Monte Carlo, so there might be some changes by this time next week. But again, let me know down in the comments below. Are you shocked by any of these, or are you surprised that they haven't been more changes. So only the one change in the top 10 for the men or the women, Kvitova, back in the top 10. 